Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to show you how to convert the exported gameplay footage from your PS5, which records in WebM. Currently, there's two formats. For 4K, you have to use WebM. And for 1080p, it'll use MP4, which is more compatible with video editors. But if you want the 4K footage into your editing suite like iMovie, Final Cut Pro, and Resolve, you got to do a conversion. And we're going to do that conversion using a program called Handbrake. And Handbrake allows you to do conversions between multiple formats. And it's free. It's open source. So it's, it's all good in my book. Okay. So what we're going to do now is open up Handbrake. Let me close this down. And we're going to pick the footage here, which is the Astros Playroom gameplay I just recorded. And it's in that WebM format. We're going to hit open. We're going to allow Handbrake to do its thing. And what we got to do is pick your format. The format right that we want to do is MP4. But there's other formats you can change to if you want to. So you can use this with any. Pretty much it'll convert any video format to any video format. All right. And then you want it to end up being in a format that you want to edit. So we want to keep it 4K. At least I do. Um, and I found a pretty decent one here is the Vimeo YouTube high quality 2160p 64K. So that's the one I've been using. But there's other formats you can kind of do a lot of manual configuration if you want. But let's just do that one. Let's go ahead and click that. And then when you're ready to start, you hit that start button. And depending on the power of your system is going to and the size of the file here, it's going to depend on how long it's going to take. This one will take a while. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward now and we'll be right back in a snap. Okay, we're closing in on the finish line here. Just about finished with the conversion. Alrighty, we are officially done converting a WebM 4K video into a MP4. Okay, so let's do a little comparison here. Let's see what we got with the output. The original one here. We'll check out the information on it right there. And with the newly converted one. Let's check out the information here. So original one is 1.56 gigabytes and the converted one is 671. Now we probably lost some detail in the conversion here to the YouTube Vimeo 4K kind of conversion. But if you aren't happy with the quality and you want to go into Handbrake and mess with the settings, you can do that. But I just wanted to show you how to do a really quick conversion. And that's it for today's video. All right. Thanks, everybody. See you in the next one. Peace and aloha.